Tonight, I'd like to give gratitude, immense gratitude for Christian science and its revealing of our oneness with God, God's almighty allness, which helps with the progress to uncover every error as nothing. That error cannot be real if God never created it. On page 92 of Science and Health, we find that on line 21. Until the fact concerning error, namely its nothingness appears, the moral demand will not be met and the ability to make nothing of error will be wanting. I'm so grateful for this, and I thank God that through what Mrs. Eddy left all mankind, our oneness with God is becoming clearer and clearer. From this standpoint, we see that nothing of the temptations that come and dismissing them as nothingness and powerless also becomes more effective. We must do this. We must always, every day, keep knowing our oneness with God and the nothingness of error. Because if we don't do that, we're dishonoring God and really saying as if he could have created a sick, sinning man as his own image and likeness. And how can we progress from such a basis? I am so grateful really for also what he, she tells us our third duty is. It says, it shall be the duty of every member of this church to defend himself daily against aggressive mental suggestion and not be made to forget nor to neglect his duty to God, to his leader and to mankind. By his works he shall be judged or, and justified or condemned. This has been very helpful because it really helps in daily, not my practicing myself or others. And I hope we all, we all are learning from this because it helps us to see God's honor, to love him more. And in, this, in doing this, it helps the, the malpracticing that we, we tend to do, sometimes quite on not being aware that we're doing it self-depreciation and all the, all the wrong things that we admit for ourselves. And how can we know the nothingness of error if we don't know the all goodness that God has made his children? I am so grateful to be here tonight and thanks for all the testimonies that attest to the potency of truth and love.